Specifically, here is what we've been working to try to bring about. At this moment, we are working towards a brief seven days of peace, seven days of a humanitarian ceasefire in honor of Eid, in order to be able to bring people together to try to work to create a more durable, sustainable ceasefire for the long run, and to work to create the plans for that long haul. So we begin with at least the hope of a down payment on a ceasefire, with the possibility of extension, a real possibility in the course of tomorrow. Uh, and hopefully, if we can make some progress, the people in this region who deserve peace can find at least one step uh, towards that elusive goal. Now, why are we not announcing that that has been found yet tonight? For a simple reason, that we still have some terminology in the context of the framework to work through. But we are confident we have a fundamental framework that can and will ultimately work. And what we need to do is continue to work for that. And that's exactly what we're going to do. We believe that seven days will give all the parties the opportunity to step back from the violence and focus on the underlying causes, perhaps take some steps that could build some confidence and begin to change the choices for all. We don't yet have that final framework, but I will tell you this, none of us here are stopping. We are going to continue the conversations. And right now, before I came in here tonight, I had conversations with people on both sides of this uh, conflict, just spoke to Prime Minister Netanyahu, who made it clear that he wants to try to find this uh, way forward. <laughs> Thank you.